Apple Gift Card is a practical gift that unlocks a world of entertainment and fun. You can send it via email or give a physical card to your loved ones. Your friends and family can spend it on their favorite Apple services, including Apple subscriptions. Apple Gift Card can be used to buy all things Apple. Products, accessories, apps, games, movies, TV shows, iCloud Plus, and more. Visit apple.com for details and to send Apple gift cards to your friends and family this holiday season. Okay, what's up, guys? Welcome to another episode of the TMOS Boss Show. Um, I don't know. I want to have, like, somewhere it's, like, YouTube-related, but... Then again, I'm like, there ain't too many, like, things I can, like, really talk about that's going on with YouTube right now. The one thing that I did want to talk about, but I'm like, I don't know if I could carry on with that for 15 minutes, but people commenting first on videos. I plan on making a video about it because I, I just need my fans to know real quick, like... I don't care if you're first on my video. Like, that's the type of stuff where I'm like, bro, like, you would have thought that would have died off, like, years ago. Like, people still commenting first. Like, it's, like, a challenge. Like, you gonna win something if you're first. Like, I don't care. Like, I don't pay attention to the first comments. Like, I made a video a while ago. That I'm, yeah, that's why I'm like, I'm gonna make, like, a 2020 edition because I feel like um, a good portion of my, like, newer fans they might not yeah actually yeah i, I have to say like the majority of my fans because it wasn't a much more older video but the video did kind of go viral it was a lot of people was commenting on it and talking about it, and they were agreeing with me like it doesn't matter if you're first like my thing is is that i want comments about the video you know like i want comments that's like actually talking about something like that I can respond to like if it's some stuff where I'm like first like originally I you know I remember I like I was with it I remember when uh when I started getting well it was like you know you kind of like very first blow up like on YouTube and stuff then uh you know you get comments like that and you're all like oh okay cool and you know you're like second third or whatever but now it's like people they just that's honestly like I got uh from the same person like he made sure he coming on all the recent videos I uploaded saying first I'm like bro nobody on my channel at least I don't care maybe with other people they might have that where it's a challenge but I'm like not with me I'm like I if I go through the comments that I'll reply to a comment that's like talking about the video or if they're saying something that's like you know responsive then yeah I'll respond to that first before I respond to a first comment so. I don't care about them first comments, but I know that'll probably, like, make so many people upset. I'll probably lose some subscribers saying some stuff like that. But I'm like, no, I don't want that on my channel. Like, I just don't. I know I was like, I can't stop people from commenting what they want to comment and stuff. But to me, it's just pointless. Like, you're not getting anywhere if you're commenting first. Like, that's the type of stuff where I'm like, yeah, I just, I don't ever see myself doing that. Like, I like to usually, with me at least, I know when I like a video gets uploaded, I don't usually watch the video, unless it's like a YouTuber that I really like, but if it's a video I know I can like wait on, yeah, I'll like go and be like, oh, I'll watch that video later on tonight, like, I can care less if I'm the first view, first comment, first like, like, I don't, I don't care about any of that stuff. And half of the time, like, people that be doing that, they're not like the first view or the first, like, they don't realize that people are clicking on that video the same time you're clicking on it and stuff. Like, you're not the only one that subscribed to my channel. I have 17 out of 1,000 people subscribed to my channel. So just know, like, yeah, I guess, like, yeah, if you are the first comment, then you are. But it just it doesn't mean anything. Like, it's pointless to, to me, at least. Maybe the other people, it's like a goal or something. But I'm like, I don't, I personally don't care. That's one trend now, honestly. I'm like, I can't wait for that to die off. Because I'm like, yeah, I just, I, I want comments about the video that I like, you know, that I'm like uploading and things. That's just, I guess like, yeah, to talk on comments on YouTube, there's like a few comments. I don't, yeah, I don't really care for uh, first comments. Um, I guess like reaction requests. If it's on, I don't know, it depends on like, if I do one of those like community posts or if I do a video saying like, hey... Can you, uh, um, com like, you know, comment some videos you guys want me to react to? I don't mind if it's that, but if I'm, like, shouting out somebody or if I'm uh, uploading, a like, a some sort of video where it's not, like, a reaction or anything else. Like, I've, it was, like, when I uploaded, I uploaded some uh, music and then it was um, a video to reacting to my uh, friends, Four Souls, and people was, like, 
just completely bypassing what I just uploaded and was just like, hey, can you react to this? And I'm like, that's the type of stuff where I'm like, if you were having a conversation with somebody and they just said like, they just cut you off and just say like, hey, can you do this real quick? Like, that would be kind of rude, right? Like, that's, yeah, I'm just, I don't know, with me, I guess like with the reaction request, like, I am going to see it. I, I, that's one thing that I just don't like is when people, they comment their reaction requests like multiple times. Like, I trust me, I seen it. I have it open. I plan on reacting to it. Just know that there is other people wanting me to react to certain videos. When I get the chance to, trust me, I will react to your video. But, um, yeah, people, they just, uh, they get like a little bit too overboard with those reaction requests. I'm like, dang, like, I didn't realize that it was that important for me to react to a video. Like, people, they just be, like, really, like, counting on that stuff. Like, I don't know. With me, at least, if a YouTuber, I see, that's the thing. Because I'm like, I'm always, I don't, it's rare for me to, like, you know, watch a video outside of a reaction video and things. Like, I, if it's, like, videos I've already seen before or if it's YouTubers that's, um, they upload reaction videos or if it's YouTubers that have been watching since before I did reaction videos. Because there's YouTubers that I watch and I've been watching them for years. And, um, I, yeah, I just, like, just don't react to them. I know one YouTuber that, um, don't, there's a couple, there's a couple because there's one, I, I think he doesn't care if um, people react to his videos. And then the other one, I remember he came out and said that he doesn't want people reacting to his videos. And I respected that, but... Uh, Vanos Gaming, he's the one, I don't know, because I see where people react to his videos, but I've been watching him since, uh, Grand Theft Auto V, like, when it, um, originally got released, so, uh, yeah, I had been watching him all the way then, and just been watching his videos, so it just, it wouldn't, to me, it wouldn't make any sense to, like, react to his, uh, videos, because I know people, they've commented, and they've wanted me to react to his, uh, videos, I'm like, I've seen, I think I said that in the video, I'm all like, I've seen, like, a good, like, maybe 90% of his videos, so any video that you guys like ask me of like and the percentage is probably it might be like 95 like between 95 and 98 like I've seen like a good portion of his videos so if I do react to it it's going to be a video I've already seen before that's what somebody commented I was just all like any video that I react to like I guess like maybe if I watch like the first few seconds that's like honestly the only time when I'm like seeing a video outside of a reaction but if I'm reacting to the video that's my first time ever watching the video. Somebody had, like, commented and was all like, oh, it seems like that he um, watches the video and then reacts to it afterwards. I'm like, I don't do that. I don't do that. I, I react. When I'm watching the video for the first time, that is when the reaction video starts. I, I was like, that, and I told him that. I'm like, that's defeating the purpose of a reaction video. And if you watch the video, then there's no reason to react to the video. I guess, like, I can say, like, commentary over the video and be all like, oh, I've seen this and wanted to, like, I, if, if I had seen the video, like, before, I would let people know. I'm not going to go and react to a video and make it seem like it's my first time ever uh um like or yeah make it seem like it's my first time ever seen it even though i had watched it numerous times like no i'm gonna tell y'all straight up never seen this video before don't know what i'm getting into if i call something that happens like a couple of seconds after i called it there's just a coincidence but i don't do that i'm i'm like i'm sorry if you know you want to believe that it's just it's not going to be true so but uh, i feel like there's just going to be people that like runs with that nigga about like tmos boss he watches uh, videos, he um, he reacts to videos he's already watched. I'm like, it just, it wouldn't make any sense. Like, uh, to me, it's just like I said, it's defeating the purpose of a reaction video. But anyways, what other comments do I be getting on YouTube? Uh, oh, I know, I remember this one dude. I think, I yeah, I could just, like, talk about, like, my, um yeah, I don't think that's going to be this. Just this whole episode, just YouTube comments, like, the comments that I've received so far. But I remember... Uh, a while ago so there's this uh, for so for those that have been subscribed to my channel for a few years you guys are um, but if even if you subscribe to my channel maybe like a couple of months ago and you've seen those videos so i'm pretty sure for those that have seen my mcjugger nuggets uh reaction videos so maybe two years ago i think it was probably about two years ago this uh it was it's about two probably like two or three years ago but anyways so this guy 
he was he wanted me to start back reacting to Mick Juggernaut's videos. I had finished all of the Mick Juggernaut videos. I reacted to pretty much all of them. I didn't know that he came back because I think he had took a break. So Mick Juggernaut to explain um, him to everybody. So he was doing these videos and they were pretty entertaining. I really did enjoy those videos. I'll probably like go back and like rewatch that series. But it was like a like TV show kind of in a way like it because people was thinking that, that it was real but I was like getting I remember I was like as I was reacting to the video and even like after reacting to the video I'm like bro that guy looked like he's older than me and if he's still living with his I'm like he's making it seems like he's making bank off of YouTube I think he's living down south so I would imagine that he's making enough to where he can he can get himself like it could be a small house or a big house but I'm saying, like, that doesn't make any sense where it's like if you're still living with a parent that's, like, destroying everything that you done worked hard for. Like, there is videos of his uh, dad, like, running over his video games on an, uh, with, a, like, one of those, like, drivable lawnmowers. What else? Um, he's buried his games, threw his games in a swimming pool. What else? There is, like, so many things his dad was doing. I was like, bro, that is some wild stuff if this is real. But uh, it was, it wasn't, like, it was like a TV show, so I, that's how I consider it. I know people was all like, it's fake, but I'm like, bro, it's a TV show. Like, it's just for entertainment. Like, YouTubers aren't allowed to, like, come out with their, like, because, I mean, what, his, it, it's not like um, he's going to get, if he, it would be dope if he did get picked up by a TV network, but I'm saying, like, you know, if you don't want to go through all of that trouble and you just want to uh, overall just like upload the stuff onto YouTube and then you own all the rights and you make all the money off of it and it's not being signed to some other company and stuff. Yeah, it's like you should. Yeah, you should definitely do that. Upload your stuff onto YouTube. But um, anyways, so he was doing these videos a while ago. He was doing these videos probably around the time when I started doing reaction videos. So anyways... He's, uh, so yeah, he's blowing up, I'm reacting and all that stuff, and then I'm, like, also blowing up with it, but then the series had ended, it ended off with him, like, I guess in a way, like, killing off the father, and then he, uh, um, disappears and stuff, but then it was pretty dope, he came out with a documentary, and he featured me in the documentary, I thought that was a really dope thing, where it was, like, one of my, uh, reaction videos was featured in it, so I'm, like, cool, dope. I was featured in the documentary. I'm definitely, that's something where people, if they ask me, it was like, oh, have you ever been featured somewhere else? I was like, this YouTuber came out with a documentary about him, and I was featured in it. So, uh, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm going to take that. I'm going to take that credit. But anyways, so after that, then it was like it was over with. It was done. You know, there wasn't anything else to uh, watch after it. So I moved on. I was reacting to, uh, like, other YouTubers and all that stuff. So anyways... Probably like fast forward that next year, a couple of years later, I guess he came back and he started uploading like those videos again. And um, I, I don't know. I just, I guess like I wouldn't, I would be open to react to his videos again. But at the same time, I was just like, I kind of like finished off the series. And so I'm like, I don't know, like anything afterwards. I'm like, it's not that I didn't like his videos. I did like, I really did enjoy his videos. I thought his videos were some of the best videos um, on YouTube because they were like, they were really entertaining and stuff. So I guess I just didn't have the desire to react to his videos anymore. I was just like, oh, I've like reacted to enough. So I'm like, you know, I'm just going to move on in things. You know, it's just uh, something that's just not really in my path right now to react to his videos and there's no disrespect to mick jugger nuggets and his family i seriously like those those would be some guys i would like to collaborate want to um collaborate with one day because i'm like just to tell them like it is like dope that i was like a fan reacting to your guys' videos and now all of a sudden i'm collaborating with you guys so yeah i'm like i respect mick jugger nuggets in a way, he has helped out my channel a lot. He might have not personally shouted me out, but allowing me to react to his videos and then it's building up a fame like off of like doing that. Yeah, I'm like, I, uh, yeah, that's something I'm just like, you know, I'm definitely going to uh, always be grateful for somebody like him. You know, he did kind of help my channel grow and stuff. So and he's helped out. A I would have to say like anybody that he allowed to react to their videos. That's why I'm like when people, when they get mad at people that do reaction videos, I don't think you're realizing like when they do that reaction video, they're, help they're helping the YouTuber that they react to grow. And then that person that's um, allowing them to react to the video, they're growing too. So I'm like, that's what YouTube is all about, is growth, right? So, but anyways, um, so yeah, fast forward like two years after he ended off the series, then he started back uploading again. 
And this guy, he was like commenting time after time after time saying like, hey, can you react to the um, McJuggernaggy? Can you react to McJuggernaggy? So I think I did react to a couple of videos. But then he just started getting carried away with it. And then it got to the point where it's like, I had to come out and like tell him like, hey, dude, you need to chill out because it's not that serious. And he was like, and then it got so bad that where he was creating, that's why I'm like, I don't like when people do stuff like that. That's like, that's a like, well, I guess it's like, it's like probably like one of my like least pet peeves, like a, like, le not memorable, but um like annoying, like least annoying pet peeve is when people, because it's something that's like not going to like make me lose sleep at night. But when people create multiple accounts and they're commenting like, on your account like just using different accounts and stuff and i'm like no nah, don't do that don't don't do that like i've seen like you don't have to that's my thing where i'm like in my comment sections you don't have to comment a hundred million times to get me to react to a video that's actually like going to do the opposite i'm not going to want to i'm just going to lose interest in that video when people do stuff like that because to me, I'm like, okay, I seen your comment. Like, it's cool. I understand. Like, you know, you want me to react to this video. When I get the chance to, I will react to it. But you don't have to comment a hundred million times off of all these different accounts. That's what I'm like. I just, I don't like when people do that. I'm like, bro, just chill out. Like, I seen it. Like, you can calm down. All right. That's a, that, that, then kind of like a similar situation is when uh, you say something in the video. And then one person comments like, oh, you messed up when you said that. Then another person comments and then another person. It gets to the point where you're all like, okay, like I seen the first comment. Did you, you guys not see it? Because I've I seen it. So I already know what you're talking about. Like you don't have to like keep commenting time after time after time. Like read through the comments. Like make sure other people. That's why I'm like always um, before I like leave a comment. I know when people... If there's like, for an example, a song that's playing and I go in the comment sections and then there's people are like, uh, oh, what's the name of that song? I will scroll through them comment sections. And if I don't see nobody else comment the song, then that's when I will comment the song. But if I see somebody else had commented to the song, then I'm like, then there's no reason for me to comment the song. Why should I? And somebody else like, I don't want to like take anything from that person. I'm like, let them get their likes and all that stuff for commenting the name of the song. So... But yeah, anyways, this guy was like using different accounts and it was getting pretty annoying because I'm like, bro, I don't want my like YouTube channel to be flooded with fake accounts and stuff. So because no, I remember for a while I was doing Q&A videos and um, he was like using like different accounts, but it was like based like the question that he would ask me was based off of the account that he was using. So if it was um, like toilet paper like that was the name of the uh, um account then he'll comment or he'll ask me a question if i do a q a he was like when was the last time you bought toilet paper or be like hot dog buns and like when was the last time you ate a hot dog bun or if it was uh like iphone use and it was just like what's the um like what's the greatest iphone that you ever had like it's stuff like that but he was doing that and i'm all like bro like and i saw so i had stopped doing the q a's I stopped like altogether reacting to McDougan Nuggets and I'm like, I'm not going to, I think I did come out in the video saying like, I'm no longer going to do Q and A's and I'm no longer going to do a uh, McDougan Nugget reaction video. So to whoever this guy is, blame him because he's, you know, like trying to make it seem like I got like fake people on my account. And I'm like, I'm not with that. I'm not with that at all. Like, I know if, like, if you have, like, inactive subscribers, like, subscribers that might have watched your videos years ago, and they subscribed to you at the time, but they don't watch your videos now, I don't mind that. I don't mind that at all. I'm like, you know, like, at least this was, like, at least it's real, though. Like, they were watching my videos, and they were commenting at one point, but now, like, they're not, you know, they're focused on other YouTubers that they're like, like, I'm not gonna stop somebody. That's, I guess, like, one thing people I've seen where they've commented on my channel is that they say that I have uh, inactive subscribers. Every YouTuber has inactive subscribers. Every YouTuber has inactive subscribers. You could go to PewDiePie. He's not getting 100 million uh, views across all his videos. You can go to KSI. He's How many subscribers does he have? Because I'm saying, like, every YouTuber known to mankind, they have all, they all have at least as one inactive subscriber or 100 million in that, um, active. So he has on his, so on his second channel. Wait, what happened to his main channel? Oh, there's his main channel. I was like, wait a minute. Did he take down his main channel? Is that Jake Paul? Dang, Jake Paul, he look young there. He don't even look real. He don't even look like Jake Paul no more. That's some. Um, that that's look like a knockoff version of that is not Jake Paul. I'm sorry, but that's just that's not him. But anyways, yeah. So he has 
KSI has 21 million subscribers, and on his last video that he uploaded, is that the last video that he uploaded? Is it a song? Uploads. Oh, he's premiering the video tomorrow. But the last video that he uploaded, it got 3 million views. So, and he has 21 million subscribers, but that video got 3 million views. So that's a clear indication he has inactive subscribers. PewDiePie, let's look him up. PewDiePie, he uploaded, yeah, so he has 105 million subscribers. He uploaded a video yesterday that got 3 million uh, views, and then he uploaded another video an hour ago. I might have to check that video out. I, I, yeah, I, I forgot that PewDiePie does reaction videos. It's just funny how people, they get on um, people about doing reaction videos, but you got the biggest YouTuber in the world doing reaction videos. But anyways, um, but yeah, that video got uh, a little under 500,000 um, views. So I'm saying like every YouTuber has inactive subscribers. I remember when people was commenting that on my channel and they was just like, oh, you have um, inactive subscribers. I'm like, everybody does. You can even, like, there's even times when YouTubers, they'll post about how the majority of the people that watches their videos are not subscribed, and then that's why, you know, they'll blow it up in their videos, like, hey, like, make sure you uh, subscribe to the channel, and it's, you know, it's helpful, post notifications, all that stuff, because uh, there is one YouTuber, we're, like, roughly the same, where it's, like, 20% of the users watches and i know i've done that with youtubers like i'll go to their channel and watch like a couple of videos but i'm not subscribed to them and stuff so um anyways yeah but uh, it's like they'll show where it's like 20 percent of uh the youtubers that are subscribed or people that subscribe to you they're watching your videos but then 70 percent are not subscribed to you but they're still watching your videos regardless and i guess like that that should be an eye opener where it's like it shouldn't matter whether the person subscribed or not like if they are subscribed cool but still at the end of the day like they're still watching your videos so at you know it's truly it is up to them if they want to subscribe to your channel and things but coming from a person like me when you're uploading like seven videos a day yeah i would imagine that that would be a little bit overwhelming so i'm like yeah i'm like you know maybe i could slow down on um uploading but i'm all like no i don't want to i don't, I don't like slowing down so but anyways um but yeah, people, they were commenting that. I was just like, that's dumb because that's with every YouTuber. Even the haters that have made videos about me, that's the same thing with them. Let's see, yeah, let's let's go ahead and look that up. Let's look up uh, just the robot. The main, the main, the head honcho leading the hate. So he uploaded a video. So he has 171,000 subscribers and he uploaded a video um, almost a week ago with only 16,000 views. I'm... Where's the rest of them? Like, that's, I'm like, it's people. You guys gotta understand how the YouTube, like, things work. Like, if you taking YouTube as a hobby, or if you're doing YouTube as a hobby, you're not gonna understand how any of this stuff works out, so. But anyways, um, what other comments have I, um, that's annoyed me? Well, yeah, then there was, yeah, I was, um, that's what I was originally talking about, was a guy creating multiple accounts, like, commenting like hey can you so he was like so that's why he stopped doing your mcjuggernuggets reaction videos because he would comment off of those different accounts so like it'll be like the iphone user hot dog bun toilet paper he'll use those accounts and will comment on my latest videos and it wouldn't even have anything to do with mcjuggernuggets it'll be like me shouting out a friend and he'll leave like multiple comments saying hey can you react to this mcjuggernuggets video hey can you react to it and it was just copy and paste on each account so I'm like, I know for a fact ain't 20 people ain't said the same thing all within an hour. I'm like, nah, that's not normal. So yeah, I um I made a video and I said like, yeah, I'm I'm not reacting to uh McJugger Nuggets anymore. Like I would one day, but I'm like, you know, I'm fixing my microphone right now, so if you're hearing like some noises, but Anyways, um, yeah, I was like, no, nah, I'm done reacting to uh, McJugger Nuggets. It's no disrespect to him. I'm always going to respect McJugger Nuggets. If one day me and him become friends, I'll be cool with that. But um, I just don't, I don't see myself reacting to any more of his videos because whoever that guy was had ruined it for everybody. You know, there were people I, um, at, the t um, at the time that was like, you know, watching, they wanted re um, McJugger Nuggets videos and they wanted me to uh, react to them. But that guy ruined it. So I was like, yeah, to whoever that guy is, you can um, use those 20 accounts that you comment on. Unsubscribe. I don't even know if he subscribed to me on any of those accounts. But I'm like, if you did, I was like, you can unsubscribe for me. If I lose 20 subscribers, oh, well. Like, I would rather lose 20 subscribers than, have, than to have 20 fake accounts commenting on my channel and stuff. So 
anyways, um, yeah, that guy, I was like, too, that was, that was just, like, really annoying, I'm like, bro, don't do stuff like that, I'm like, I'd seen the first comment, you ain't gotta use it, like, a hundred million times to, uh, do that, he's probably, he's probably the guy that tried to, like, set me up with that, uh, suicidal girl situation, because I'm saying, like, I, I, he could, there's, like, yeah, there, he could be the same person, because there's been some, like, somebody on my channel that's been doing that ever since I started doing it, it might be that Glenn kid, because I'm saying, like, I remember that Glenn kid, he was doing that, but, I don't know, somebody, he, or maybe just people were just, it's a common thing to do, like, creating multiple accounts, I'm like, I have 20 accounts, but I use them all to upload videos, like, I'm not using them to comment on people's videos, or subscribe to anybody yet, it's like, the only channels I use to subscribe to people are my, um, main channel and my gaming channel, any other channel, I don't subscribe to a person off of that channel, so, if I did, and it's probably by accident, because I was uploading videos on that channel and forgot to switch accounts, so, but yeah, I, um, I only use, uh, one, or yeah, two channels to subscribe to people, and, uh, yeah, I'm like, that's, that's about it, but, Anyways, what other things do I get in the comment sections that's, oh, I don't, yeah, I, I, oh, I talked about that, how people, they, um, they'll comment the same thing, well, it's like, from, like, different people will comment, like, they won't go through the comment section and see if somebody else commented it, but, anyways, what else can I talk about about the comment sections, um, I think I've pretty much discussed everything. There was, like, something, like, right there in my head that I could have, like, that I was about to mention, but then I got distracted. Dang it. I hate when that happens. Man. I really... Oh, when people, when they comment, and they don't even watch your video. Well, that's kind of like when people, when they comment saying, like, hey, react to such and such, because you think, like, they're not even, they didn't even watch the, they didn't even bother to watch the video, like... Alright, cool. Like I said, uh, my video didn't matter and stuff. They've been watching. When I do upload that reaction, they're not even watching that. They just keep commenting, react to this, react to this. But, no, I don't like when people, because I know when reaction videos was facing, like, a lot of heat and backlash a few years ago, people would comment on my channel saying, like, oh, you didn't even watch the video, or, um, you, uh, didn't even, like, have a reaction. You just sat there in silence. And I'm like, I sat there in silence? I talked throughout the whole video. There was more of me talking than the reaction video. Like, I don't even understand that. I'm like, what are you talking about? I'm like, you, obviously you didn't watch the video. If you had watched the video, you would have known that, yeah, the video, I'll react. Because see, here's the thing. For those that, if you, if you know me, you know that I talk. I'm like, I'm pretty sure everybody that knows me knows that I talk. So, but when I react to a video, the video would be like, let's say if it's like a movie trailer, right? Movie trailer would be like, mm, let's say it's like 2 minutes and 40 seconds long. My reaction to that video would be 10 minutes and 40 seconds long. Like, I, I'm going, I'm talking about every detail, everything that I noticed in that trailer, alright? If I didn't notice anything, then yeah, the, I'm still going to make it a long reaction video. I'm still going to give off a reaction. Because there's people out there, I've seen that do reaction videos. And you would have thought, I think I did talk about that, how... Uh, there is, I remember there was this one girl I um, was watching, she was doing reaction videos, but you would have thought, like, her reaction was meant for another video. Like, the video that she had on the screen that she was reacting to was not the video that she was reacting to. I seen when that girl, she would do reaction videos, I'm all like, is she watching the same video we're watching? Because... I'm, we're out here, like, she's watching, like, dash cam, like, crashes or something, and it sounds like she's, like, reacting to, like, top 10, like, slam dunks in NBA history, like, the stuff that she would say, I'm like, I'm, I, she's definitely not watching the same video, but that's, it's her video, it's all within one video, but it's like, she's still not watching, I'm like, what's, what's going on here, what's, what is this, what's, what's happening here, but, anyways, um, yeah, I'm like, if you guys, like, sat down and actually watched the video, then you would know, like, I'm not just sitting here in silence. I can't even think of the last time I sat down in silence in a reaction video. Like, there might be parts where I am silent, but pretty much throughout that whole video, I'll react to a video that's like 15 minutes long, and that video would be like 30 minutes long. And I've done that. There's been videos I reacted to where it's Hot T's videos. Hot T, so uh, if you guys, shout out to her if you guys haven't, go subscribe to her. But she, uh, she'll do like 10 minute videos where she's like talking about like, like news and stuff. Then my reactions, my reactions to the, uh, video, my reactions, there I got a notification on my phone, tried to distract me, but my reactions to her videos would go for like maybe 20, 30 minutes. And her videos are like 10 minutes long. 
sometimes maybe 15 minutes, but there's far more. There's like bonus content that's like added to the, uh, like mine's is like the extended version when you get a reaction out of me and stuff. So anyways, a lot of people like my reaction. I've had where people contacted me. They wanted me to specially react to their videos and stuff. I guess just because they like my reaction. I'm like, I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. But anyways, um, yeah, you know, it's, uh, yeah, it's like reaction videos. They're cool. I like them, but comments though like just just talk about the video bruh like that's that's all i ask for just talk about the video no oh, that's a good stretch that's a very good stretch you know the stretch is good when it changes your voice but anyways um yeah that's all i can really think about talking about today so uh yeah i guess i'll talk to you guys later thank you guys for watching and or listening if you're viewing this on youtube make sure you like and subscribe and if you're viewing this off of a podcast streaming service Make sure you follow or subscribe, however it's set up. And if you're purchasing tickets from SeatGeek, make sure you use my promo code TMOSBOSS. It will knock $20 off your first purchase. And that being said, I will talk to you guys later. Thank you guys for watching and or listening, and peace.